Hello, and in this lesson, we are going to learn how to repeat the header rows on every page. Now, suppose that we are working with a really long table that spans several pages, and we want the header row to appear at top of every page. Now, you might be tempted to do it manually, so just copy and then paste it. But please don't do so, because not only will you need to reformat the table heading again for each page, but later when the table grows, or more text are being added, so I'm going to add a few more rows here, and you can see that the table heading will be pushed down and we'll need to reformat it again every time the table grows or more text are being added. So a better alternative is to let what handle this first. All we need to do is to select the table heading, go to table layout, and go all the way down towards the right hand side of the screen, and select repeat header rows and you can see that the header row is now being repeated on top of every page and what's even better is that whenever the table grows so i'm going to add a few more uh, columns and you can see that even when we add more data or we add more rows the table heading will still remain on top of every page which is exactly what we want now, some of you might be wondering, this is great, but sometimes I have a complex table that has two header rows instead of one. Could we do that? And will we be intelligent enough to understand that we want to repeat the header rows for multiple headings? All right, so let's see what happens. Select the heading and then go to layout. Click on repeat header rows. And yes, it is smart enough to understand that, you know, sometimes a two-line heading happens and it will repeat all the headings for us. If you look closely at the repeat header rows, it is actually say repeat header rows. So it understands that a multiple row heading happens. And that's it. Happy learning and see you in the next lesson.